Hello, YouTube community. It's Robert S. And welcome back to Rob's Your Music, where I hope to introduce you or reacquaint you with lesser known artists and or albums that are out there in the musical universe. So today I want to talk to you about a group called Barnaby By. This is a Long Island band that was formed in 1973 by Pepe Castro, twin brothers Billy and Bobby Alessi, and Mike Ricciardella. And the group was formed when um, Pepe Castro, formerly of the group Blues Magoos, and this is their uh, debut album that I have. Um, he was actually in the Broadway production of Hair, along with Billy and Bobby Alessi. So the three of them met, decided to form a group. Um, Mike was added as the drummer. They signed to Atlantic Records, and in the early 70s, they released two albums. Their first album is this one called Room to Grow. Here's the track listing. And what I'll do is towards the end of this video, I'll have some clips uh, from some of the songs on this album, as well as their second album. <clears throat> and this album is very much, you know, um, pop rock, uh, lots of ha harmony. Uh, obviously, twin brothers are, are harmonizing, um, as is um, Pepe, uh, Mike. They, they all did vocals, basically. Um, they're all songwriters. Um, Billy and Bobby uh, really shared most of the um, songwriting with Pepe, and uh, the three of them came up with some wonderful music. So songs that I particularly like on this are The Day Came On, I Feel For You, I Think I'm Gonna Like It, The Way, which is a very short, I don't even think it's a minute long, uh, Linnea, uh, Jesse Girl is kind of fun. It's about uh, a woman that owns a candy shop, and it, it, it sort of tells the story of the kids hanging out in the candy shop, and uh, eventually, you know, it's an older woman who, I guess, lives alone who owns the shop, and the kids are sort of her friends, if you will, but, uh, you know, she likes to chase them away from the, uh, the store when they're hanging out too much, but... Um, you know, she, one day she, she dies and nobody knows what happened to her. And, uh, the kids are the only ones that show up at her funeral and, uh, nice, nice touching song, if you will. Um, Dreamer, very good song. Um, something good about nothing. And then they actually cover the Beatles song, She's Leaving Home. And I'll, I'll include that on the, uh, songs towards the end of this. So, again, this was an album that they released in, in 73. Then in 1974, they came out with their second album, Touch. I apologize for the crack in the case. <clears throat> Here's a song listing. And again, you know, Billy, Bobby, and Peppy are sharing the, the uh, primary songwriting responsibility here. Uh, fantastic album. Um, somewhat more rock and roll than the first album. Um, fantastic songs again. Blonde, Can't Live This Way, Jamie, Damn You Girl. I mean, honestly, I like I like everything on here. Being a star, tumbling in. Uh, growing up, there was uh, a bar that I frequented called the Tumbling In. And of course, Barnaby Bai was on the jukebox there, so we were always listening to Barnaby Bai, and especially Tumbling In. I mean, you got to listen to that song when you're in a place called Tumbling In. Um, Happy Was the Day We Met, White Tornado, Take Me With You, So It Ends This Way. 
absolutely fantastic. So <clears throat> unfortunately, um, after the release of those two albums, um, they, they kind of went their separate ways. Um, Mike R Ricky O'Deller would actually continue to drum. He played with um, a number of different uh, bands. He was in a band called um, Aviator, I believe, uh, Wiggy Bits. And he actually played with Alice Cooper. And I know he was on the um, uh, Alice's album from the inside. Uh, Pepe Castro would go on to play with a number of different musicians. He played with Michael Bolton, Liza Minnelli, Ronnie Spector. He played with um, Gene Simmons uh, solo. He did Ace Freely solo, uh, Joan Jett, uh, as well as others. And his songs have been covered by Diana Ross and Kiss and, um, uh, and others. <laughs> oh boy. And um, of course, the Alessi brothers went on to form their own group called uh, simply Alessi. And um, Alessi would release a number of different albums. This was, oops, sorry about that. <laughs> this was their debut album. Absolutely fantastic album. Um, second album, third, and so on. But uh, we'll, we'll save that for another video. <clears throat> the point is they went on to have some success. Uh, they actually had a single called Oh Lori, which was very popular, particularly in Europe. So they did very well with that. Um, they would also, the, the band members would actually um, reconnect in, um, I would say maybe 2008 or so, they released an album called Thrice Upon a Time. And um, I don't have that, that album. I wish I did. If anybody knows how I can get that, please let me know. If, if by some miracle, Billy, Bobby, Mike, or Peppy, if you're watching this, uh, let me know how I can get that third album. I'd, I'd love to get my hands on it. Anyway, um, where, was I, <laughs> where was I going with this? Oh, yeah. So they, so they had this uh, third album, Thrice Upon a Time. And... That was actually inspired by a poem on the, that they put on the back of their second album. This was something that was written by Mary Kelly. And, um, <clears throat> and I'll, I'll, uh, if I can, it's very small print, but if I can, I'll read this to you. Um, Thrice upon a time, much past two o'clock, in the middle of the moonlight, Etta Jean stepped off and floated by 11 purple pumpkins. Father, no time at all, hopped on his lime popsicle for always, always land, and Barnaby by, and the band of head began the beguine of whistle gone by. Moaned and groaned, and maybe dreamed, Etta Jean replied, now I'll never get to kingdom go by Tuesday next, the day before. So ho, sighed the thing with a most serious sigh, and have you thought of all you mustard? Why, no, she realized. Well, you mustard, he said. And did you watch the western sky when it was 8.15? And did you listen when the branches rattled on the trees and whispered wind of out to sea with all freezer cold and winter breeze? Oh, you see, she saw, and so do I. I'll trace my motives hence once more. But hurry back, he shook his Jupiter finger. Make a pretty listen, lest you linger. Once a person sat and stopped, and all his searching stars he dropped. Washed himself in cold blue snow, forgot the why he had to go. Then walk with me a little way, she heard her mouth begin to say. The never lever must be pressed. I'll be myself, you'll be my guest. No, you won't, my little fool. You'll break the first and foremost rule. To learn to be what is twice free. We'll never meet again, but then you'll always be a part of me. So, um, that's the story of Wanna Be By. They weren't, like I said, weren't together too long. Um, they did re reconnect. Uh, they continued to play music. Um, I've, I've loved 
Barnaby Bai and Alessi's music for a very long time. I will now play the uh, clip with the, the music and this might run around 18, 19 minutes, um, but I think it's going to be an enjoyable listen. So I'll see you on the other side. Jessie girl owned a candy store on Myrtle Avenue. She was mean as a hen and she kept to herself. She was skinny and old and her teeth were all gold. I do believe she shined them too. Well, us kids. We used to come after school for a double ice cream cone And we'd hang around reading comic books on a yellow summer day 
So she chased us all away I do believe she liked it too All the women used to come around when the washing was done Just to pass the time drinking lemon wine in the evening sun In an old paisley dress, her hair was always a mess Well my mama she used to say She always lived a Christian way And she never went to church Cause she always had to work But she had a heart of gold Dreamer Guess I'm a dreamer too Something I feel like a black
touched my heart To think you were looking at me Calling me, wanting me You, you knocked me off my feet My night was so complete How could I know? Ooh. You took me in Strummed on the strings of love You played me well I couldn't tell 
So that's it. I hope you enjoyed the music and enjoyed this video. If you did, please hit that like button. And if you're subscribed, thank you. If you're not, please subscribe and hit the notification bell so that you'll be notified when I make new content like this. Um, and as I always say in my videos, stay safe. And remember, if the music strikes a chord, let it play. <laughs>